At the time of doing this video, I'm 44 years old, and if I could go back and talk to my 20-year-old self and give him some advice, here's what I would say. Number one, you will see a massive divide between the people who took care of their bodies and those who didn't. Number two, getting eight hours of sleep and taking a nice 30-minute walk in nature is going to help you better than any health guru on the planet. Number three, sleep is the best legal performance enhancing drug on the planet. You sleep for one third of your life. You might as well make it amazing. Now, if you're wondering how to do that, I have a free guide that you can download in the description below that teaches you the protocol that we use to help clients 10X their sleep quality and have amazing nights. Number four, your parents did the best they could with what they had been taught. So one of the best things that you could do, at least for your own mental peace, is to forgive them, to avoid the resentment, and to understand that they didn't have the tools that you have right now. Number five, exercise is the most underutilized antidepressant and food is the most abused drug. Number six, what you measure is what you manage. If you wanna get better at anything, you must track it. Number seven, any list that says that you should be doing X things by 30 years old are f***ing bullshit. You have your own timing when it comes to this life. You must honor it. Number eight, as you level up, your friends are going to change. Accept this because it just is what it is. Number nine, at some point, it is going to be the last time that you spend with a friend make sure that you take every single moment and cherish them as if it were your last number 10 if you hang around someone and you feel like your energy was just zapped out of your body after hanging with them take this as a signal to not hang around that person again number 11 your diet consists of not only your food but the information you take in and the friends that you hang around be mindful of all three of these choices number 12 if you want better results, you have to find better friends. This doesn't mean that you have to get rid of the friends that you're hanging around right now, but it does mean that you have to level up in terms of the people that you surround yourself with. Number 13, the less f you give about what other people think, the more peaceful you are going to be. Number 14, your brain is a piece of software. You upgrade it by reading amazing books, doing courses, learning new skills, crushing new challenges, and choosing the people you surround yourself with. Number 15, your body is a piece of hardware that you upgrade through cardio, stretching, and lifting. Number 16, create a habit of always paying off your credit card at the end of each month. One of the quickest ways to create financial frustration is to always be mired in consumer debt. Number 17, create a habit of saving at least 10% of what you earn. And this is regardless of how much debt that you have. And the reason I say this is because the more money that you're able to see in your bank, the more secure you're going to feel overall. Number 18, make sure you learn how to invest so you can understand how to turn your dollars into more dollars. Number 19, make it a habit of spending quality time away from your phone every single day. A great life is lived outside, not in front of a screen. Number 20, learn how to be bored. The ability to be bored without having to distract yourself is a superpower in modern society. Number 21, write a vision out for your life and then break that vision down into three-year goals and then break those three-year goals down into one-year goals. And then afterwards, you wanna take those one-year goals and then break them down into quarterly projects which will then turn into monthly tasks. And then these are the tasks that you're gonna be lining up your week with. This is the formula to turning your vision into an actual reality. Number 22, train yourself to get the most important task done at the beginning of the day. This is called eating the frog. And when you do this, you are going to make sure that you are pushing your projects forward and hitting your goals and doing at least one thing every single day that gets you closer to the goals that you set for yourself. Number 23, hire mentors or coaches as fast as humanly possible. They will get you from point A to point B much faster than any book or course ever could. Number 24, 
pay whatever money it takes to get yourself into better rooms. Invest in the mastermind. Go to the conferences. This is one of the best ways to build out your network. Number 25, self-pity and arguing for your excuses are signs of learned helplessness. Avoid these at all costs because these are damaging your spirit. Number 26, if you are feeling uncomfortable, it actually means that you're growing. Instead of trying to resist it, invite it and understand that feeling this is a path to a better version of yourself. Number 27, the foods you eat affect your gut and your gut affects your brain. If you want your brain to work better, then you have to improve the quality of the foods that you put into your body. Number 28, the things you want are on the other side of facing your fears. A good life was never a comfortable life. Number 29, worrying is wasted energy. You will never make a problem better by just the sheer amount of worry that you place upon it. Number 30, a goal is simply a destination and the steps to attain it are going to be your GPS. Do not put more focus on the goal as opposed to the actual steps that's gonna take you there to get to the destination. 31, sleep is more important than food. You can go a week without food and even lose a little bit of weight. But if you go a couple days without sleep, you become the absolute worst version of yourself. Number 32, get your body to a level where food and pharmaceutical companies cannot profit off of you. Number 33, choosing who you're going to partner with in this life is going to be the most important decision that you make. Avoid making the choice based on looks alone. They have to fit your personality and values. Number 34, when you're younger, you live in the cities for more opportunities and a better network. And when you get older, you want to live in small towns, especially if you have a family, for more peace of mind and just more tranquil settings. Number 35, life is way too short to not live in the place that suits your personality. Number 36, make sure that you choose your habits and your vices wisely because the older that you get, the harder it is to break a habit. Number 37, cut off all energy and happiness vampires from your life. They will do nothing but drain you and you have to be ruthless about the people that you spend the most time around. Number 38, make sure that you get married and have kids on your own timeline and not anyone else's. Number 39, live life according to your rules, not your parents, not the people around you, and not some random dude off of the internet. Number 40, don't take anything that I said at face level. Test them out on your own, in your own life. Everyone is gonna be different. And if they work for you, awesome. If they don't, then you can disregard them and get rid of them. When I was in my 20s, I thought life would be worse when I got to my 40s. What I realized is that age is largely a factor of how you perceive it. Now I'm 44 years old and I feel much better than I did in my 20s and each year keeps on getting better and better. So if you are watching this and you're feeling a little bit lost, I hope this video pointed you in the right direction. I had a lot of fun doing it and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.